I had a special request for um, You Wear It Well. To start the song out, we're going to go on the fifth string. We're going to go open to two, down to the fourth string, open, back to two on the fifth string to open on the fourth. Then the next little part, we're going to hammer on to two on the fourth string, go open, and then hit two on the fifth. So together we'll have this. And then we're going to take our fourth string and we're going to slide to four from the second fret twice. Next little phrase is we're going to go onto the third string and we're going to hammer on from open to two back to open. And then we're going to come to the fourth string, go two open to the fifth string two. So it'll sound like this. And then we go 2-4 on the 4th string. Then we go open 2 on the 3rd. And then I hit the open B string on the 2nd string. And then do a little pull off real quick from 4 to 2 on the 3rd string. So all together the whole beginning phrase slowly. You can also do the two to four and then pull four back off. But I think he's doing the open B. So it's, it's whatever you prefer. Between the licks, there's a little um, pause, and what they do is he's sliding from the second string at the fourth fret and the third string at the fifth fret, and you're just going to slide up one fret three times. And then you're into the second half. And then we repeat the beginning part of it. And this time, we're just going to hammer on and pull off from two to four because that gets us in position for the next lick. The next lick from here is going to pull off on the fourth string from four to two. And then we're going to just kind of roll in to the B on the fifth string and pull that off to open. We're going to hit the second fret of the sixth string. And then we're going to come real fast to two, four. So together it'll sound like this. Then he hits a harmonic at the 7th fret on the G, and the 4th, and the 3rd string. And then you hit B, D twice, and you're into the verse. The verse is G, A, and D, and uh, G, A, and D twice. The G is two measures, so we go. go into an E minor to a this is an F sharp over D so for this D over F I keep my D form except I change it around a little bit I take this second finger and move it to the third string and my first finger up to the F sharp so it goes then we come to a G, so we're in position for the G, we just kind of bring this finger up, and he does a little, so that lick is G, A, B, and then we're into an A, so, so that's the chorus. You wear it well. Then we 
we're back into another verse. break just before the violin solo and it's still kind of a verse he comes in after the um, third chorus and he changes it up a little bit this is the only time so that's why I'm calling it a little break um, what he does is he goes from the D to G back to D and then to G A D so I'll play that um, from the third chorus <laughs> violin solo he goes to A and he holds that for a full measure then you go into the D twice and then back to E minor and hold that for a half measure and then you're back into the then he kind of sings since you've been gone it's hard to carry on so that break is a little bit different, but uh, that should get you through it. It's G, D, G, D. So that break is a little bit different. It's G and D, G and D, and then G, A, D. verse and the verses follow and uh, that's the whole song he carries it out with the intro licks So I hope you guys enjoy that.